welcome back how are you guys um it's a nice day out god it's gotta be like what's it like 80 almost 85 degrees outside so i thought i just don't know hop on and do some makeup kind of show i uh, kind of wanted to put some throw some things together see uh i guess what my summer look would be if i had one Maybe get one together. So here I am. So I got I got a lot of different products I want to try out. One is I'm gonna go in with this LA Girl Pro Conceal. Mine's in like a peach shade, and I just do right in here. Because you know, my inner corners suck. But how have you guys been? I have find, uh, maybe wanting to get into the bronzy, glowy look for the summer because it is hot out. You know what I mean? Why is it I'm so bothered right now? <laughs> um, as you guys seen in my last video, I had this thing here. I had it removed. It was a wart, which is weird. You know, my boyfriend calls me a witch. So, you know, there we go. Let's try some products, though. Let's play with stuff. Let's see what we like, what we don't like. Let's freaking go. All right. I did. Did I? Yes. Brought my brow, my brow pen. Okay. Let's start with the brows and see what we can come up with. They've been waxed and whatnot. This is uh, the Anastasia brow pen. That's it. Um, brow, just brow pen. Dark blonde. You guys think, can you notice a difference? Oh God, yes, that is so different. I don't know how I feel about this brow pen yet. If I'm being honest, I'm not sure what I think. Oh, there's gnats, they're driving me crazy. I forgot, it's summer now. Um, So I noticed this weird thing. Uh, There seems to be, the cicadas are out. I have not seen many where I'm at. If one lands on me during this video, yes, I'll scream and yell and freak out. But I, I've only seen a couple where I'm at. Um, and it's so weird because where my son's school is, is literally five minutes from where I live. And they have tons of them, like hundreds. But I barely have any here. So I'm not, I don't know, man. I just don't know. But um, I guess we shall see. Do you guys have one where you're at? If you do, like how many? Do you have tons? Like, or have you barely seen them? I know I have family in Florida and they, um, so they have not seen any. So, yay for you people in Florida, man. A little sweaty. 
So maybe that'll help with this glow look. <laughs> Alright, give me brow. What do you guys think? Does it not look crazy? No, it don't look crazy. Not bad. Alright, and then next. Um do some concealer. This is my hourglass in the shade Fawn. I, I don't know. I like lightening the inner corners of my eyes. Not my whole eyelid, but just the inner corner. The rest of my eye, I like to do like the same color. For me, that helps. And then... I don't know. You know what I was thinking? I have this e.l.f. contour palette. <sighs> Cream, of course. I'm thinking of maybe going in and doing some contour before foundation. Let's see how well that works. Let's try that. I did prime. Uh, I used some of the Tatcha water cream before I got on here. Breeze though. The garden we're growing in the back. This is something small. We got, um, oh my god, cucumbers, bell peppers, and zucchini. And it's a rose bush. It's struggling, and I, I don't know the first thing about uh, doing roses. So, um, yeah. What is this bump? What is this? I'm getting these bumps. I have one here, here, and then I have one over here. And they're like white bumps. I don't know if you guys know what that is. Let me know. You cannot put away paper towel. I don't know what it is, but it drives me crazy. Somebody told me it's from over moisturizing. I don't know. I just don't know about that. Put a little double chin. I every time I've been gaining weight, being in quarantine, and that's the first place. I gain weight in is my chin. My face, my whole face. I gain weight my whole face. Does anyone else do that? Or is that just me? And I always bring everything up into my hairline when contouring. Or bronzing. Either one, I do it. <sighs> and then I wanna make this thing. I like to highlight and hit in this part. 
can look darker. Okay, went more on the side. Yep. Yep, I'm hot and I'm sweaty, and this is gonna be a glowy look. And I think I'm gonna like it. go in with my NARS Tinted Moisturizer and it says uh, SPF 30 and normally I don't like um, Tinted Moisturizers because of that it's, I have very sensitive eyes and something about the SPF just burns the hell out of them but with this I've noticed I don't have that issue And why is this happening to me? All right, let's blend. I've noticed because I've been in the sun. I was in th Florida. I'm getting that mustache looking thing again. It's going to drive me crazy. So I'm back on my uh, vitamin C. And we'll see how that works. I like this um, because it's very light. I wonder what if. Now that I did it with my fingers, would that make a difference? Hmm. I don't know, I just don't know. Right here bothers me. I don't know. It seems like no matter how much I put on. Between this part and like around my nose, it doesn't seem to fit, have any coverage, no matter what I do. But I, in the summer, I don't like a lot. I guess the rest of this is on there just a little bit. Let's see, what do you guys think? Right here, see? Nothing. No coverage, no nothing. It just... It's like psych. I don't really mind though. I just need it to cover redness. I don't need much coverage. So. What's next? I'm going to try this. The... Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter Superstar Youth Glow. <laughs> Say that three times. And I like a natural glowy glow, so I'm not going for. But look how it just. Can you guys see this? It just gives you the most natural glow, like ever. I don't know. Can you see it? Oh, the sun's going in. Oh, come back out. But can you guys see the natural glow within? I don't know, but I know this, this is hopeless right here. Wonder 
bring out the hourglass see if that'll take care of that huh Shit, gaming. Hold on. Foundation lips, which I hate. Um, so I had a couple highlighters I was gonna try. Shit, I don't know if I wanna still do it. I like this natural glow type of. I did bring out the uh, hourglass <clears throat> blush in a sacred. And we're gonna give that a little bit of a go. And this blends out so good. I love this stuff. It blends out beautifully. I got no, as you can see, no issues with the blending on it at all. It's just a beautiful, beautiful product. Watch. Well, you can see the glow from the Charlotte Tilbury. See? I mean, it's beautiful. It blends out beautifully. No problem. Mine's in the color sacred. It's like a corally peachy, which is right up my alley. I don't like, with my skin tones, I don't like the whole um, pinky. It just doesn't go well. Next, I'm going to do my iconic London Sheer Bronzer. Okay. And I got mine in this... What is this? I don't really tell you, does it? Anyways, I'll <laughs> link the shade in the description box. And it just gives it a sheer glowy finish. And it's summer and you're sweating and you're hot and it's kind of what I'm all about right now. you see I mean, and it's just a sheer glow it's nothing crazy we'll leave it out we'll let it dry down we'll see if um i'm so uncomfortable if we can build it up <clears throat> highlighters so i got this little sample of the mark jacobs honeydew drops and do you i brought my iconic london and i don't know which one i want to oh i also my hourglass and champagne flash I don't know which one I want to do let's here we'll swatch up and see <clears throat> let's 
the Marc Jacobs one is a little light for me, but it looks pretty. And then Iconic London, okay. All right. Iconic London. Mark. Is this side it? Hold on. I lied. Hourglass. Mark Jacobs. Iconic London. I think for the look I'm going for, I'm going to go with. I think I'm going to. I really wanted to try out these iconic ones, but I'm going to go with the hourglass. Champagne flash. That's really, this one's fucking pretty. I don't care what anyone said. Yeah, now we're glowing. Okay. I like a natural highlight more to my skin tone. I think it suits me better. It doesn't bring out any texture when I do that. It's just a nice, healthy glow. And I need a drink. Hold on. I also want to all right let's go back with the iconic London sheer bronzer let's see what we can come up with let's try the beauty blender Can you guys notice the difference? I think it's beautiful. I mean, for summer, for spring, if you're not doing heavy makeup, this is gorgeous. And they just came out with a blush. Oh, just drop it, Sam. That's real good. They just came out with a blush, same packaging and everything. I really want to try. Um, yeah, I like it a lot. I want to go back in with. A little bit of this cooler from the Elf Contour Kit and kind of pronounce that a little bit more, just a smidge. That came off. Are you fucking kidding me? Is there anything that can cover this? So I just walk around like this because that's, you know. Let's try the brush. To the edges with the beauty blender. You know what? Fuck, I did bring some powder. I got the e.l.f. Halo Glow Setting Powder. Did I bring the wrong color? Of course I did. Just a little bit under the eyes. And what's next? I'm gonna do some eyeshadow and lips. Yep, this is a long video because I thought we're just bullshit. Why not? What else do we got to do? What else do I have to do? All right, so for eyes, do I want to prime? Yeah, I probably should prime them to be because I got some oily ass eyelids. Elf Putty Primer, and I'm just gonna. Do I have my I can 
Wait, yes, no, shit, no. I don't have my concealer brush. I can, I'll use this though. It's dense enough. All right. I like it. I could use concealer, which I'll do on the upper lid sometimes to kind of in my skin tone, but I like it. Um, an eye primer because I got I got some oily ass lids I don't really care much for the veins if I'm being honest it's just not a priority for me I just they're oily and this helps control them and so it doesn't break down my eyeshadow how my foot's falling asleep oh. We'll go back in with some of this as my brush powder. Jesus Christ, I'm making a mess. And we'll set it a little bit. Because what my plan is. over it with the beauty blender so I want to I don't want to fully set just a smidge set I like it a little bit sticky that's what works for me and I press it in there make sure that suckers in there and then I have these eyeshadow sticks so one's from covergirl one's from elf um And nothing says the damn shade 930 is the shade color. There's not really a name. It's sort of a bronzy, and that's what I do. And I'll take my finger and I blend it in. Hair? Oh, hair. Thank God. Oh, it's a bug. I did not lose my shit in a minute for a minute. Anyways, that's how I do this. I love these cream shadow sticks because they don't budge at all. And I just blend it. Blend it in with my finger. And don't worry about the edge. We'll clean that up. These things, I'm serious, they don't move on your eyes. And I just blend them. And then I'll take this e.l.f. one. It's like a champagne -y gold color, like a champagne color. And this is what I put on my lids. And I'll blend this one in too with my finger. And then I just blend it out at the top. Blend it in with this one. And that's what I do. Watch. And it works for me. It works perfect. I don't do a lot of, you know, in the summer. I don't want to mess with, why is this eye being funky? Do you see that? I don't do a lot of messing around with the eyeshadows in the summer. In our corner. You know what? I might bring that a little bit over, halfway. And yep, you can smudge it over with your finger. 
This one takes a little bit more time to dry down than the CoverGirl, but they're beautiful. They work. I'll get up close, show you guys here in a minute. Look at that, look at that chunk right there. Look oh, that came out good. Okay. And then what I like to do is I'll, oh, I'll watch my life. Just my primer open. I'll take my, is this even shutting? Yeah. I'll take my concealer to clean it up. I'm just kind of. a little bit just give it a little squeeze and I feel like I do need to have a little bit more concealer how I do it. Does this look messy? Yeah, oh, it's good. Oh my god, did I just rub this off? Fuck my life. Alright. Why do I feel like this eye is like janky looking? Don't fuck with it, Sam. Don't mess with it. And it will finish that sucker off with uh, mascara. I got the Marc Jacobs Dior. Hi, hi to me. Say hi to YouTube. weird mascara faces. Do you ever watch people though and like look at their faces? Sometimes I do. I got some mascara on. That's the trick, man. That's the trick. Oh, fuck. What is this? Okay. And then next is lips. So I have a ton of lip liners. I'm not sure what I want to do with the lips. No. Uh, yeah, you can. Go ahead. one first. Ooh. Ooh, scratchy. <laughs> Do you see one? What? Do you see one? 
What are you running for? I, I thought I saw a cable. Um, go check the steps by the basement and see if there's any there. Just I'm take a quick peek. It. That's pretty. Okay. And then I decided I get Christmas cookie Jeffree Star. I like the shade on this. Let's see. It's like a pinky nude for me. But I like to do this and then to make sure I don't have bajo lips. Look at me. Alright, I don't know. It's showing up. Let's do this. And then you get a gloss will do. And this is just the Too Faced. Um shade nightstand. That's my look for today. My paper towel's blown away here. I don't know if you guys can see the eyes. You can see how everything's glowy and natural looking. It's not a lot of makeup other than this area being a pain in my ass. I'd like to contour my nose a little bit more. But other than that, I mean, it's sheer. Everything's very sheer and glowy. And that's kind of, see my eyes? Yep, and that's kind of the look I'm going for. And that's all the products I've used. That's it. I just want to jump on, do my makeup real quick, say what's up. Um, I could probably tour a couple of things that work better for me, but um, I'm overall happy with this look. As hot as it is, this will work. And I am sweating because it's about 85 degrees out and it's humid where I'm at. I'm in Maryland. And yeah, so it. Everything looks good. It's withstanding it. I like the glow. I like to look glowy. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think for fine lines, glowy is probably your best option. Mature skin, fine lines, and I, and I have dry skin. I, I have fine lines. I'm human. Um, but I think the glowy natural look is what's up. Especially for spring and summer. And I even like this for winter but I, I use a little bit different products in winter but I do like it um because I really in winter I really need to hydrate and of course hooded eyes yeah you can see I have hooded eyes so that's kind of why I don't do a lot of fancy eyeshadow because I, my eyes you can't see nothing so this is it I'm happy with everything. You guys, let me know what your go-to summer glowy, bronzy look is. I could probably do a little bit more bronzier, but we'll try that in another video. Anyways, drop down in the comments what your go-to bronzy summer look is, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!